There we go. I don't know why my uh, stream deck's like, I'm not gonna load up properly. All right, let's go back over to Grandport. Hello. Two reasons. One, I gotta pick up Therian, because uh, we got a treasure chest we gotta go get. We have a treasure chest to get. We also have um, a few in the uh, in the actual building in the back to get as well. But the purple treasure chests have some really good stuff in them, and I regret not getting the other ones earlier in the game. That woman also dropped a knife that'll probably be good for Primrose. All right. All right, Pete, check this out. I got this NPC here. She's like, I still find myself wondering where he is now, what he might be doing. Oh, I'm sorry, did you need something of me? This little girl says, Hey, hey do you know any Kevins? My mother is sometimes searching for someone by that name. And then when you scrutinize her, she says, When I was little, my mother talked in her sleep. I could hear her at night calling someone's name over and over, louder and louder until she screamed. It was scary. She doesn't do that anymore, but I don't know if that means she's gotten better. A good day to you. I hope you're chronicling your days. A diary is a record of all you hold in your heart, you know. I've been keeping my diaries without fail for 70 years. I've got enough volumes to fill a whole library now. Don't have much to write about these days, of course. Is there still anything for an old man to experience so thrilling that it demands a recording in a diary? A good day to I'll have anything for him. I have nothing left to write. Nothing worth writing. At any rate, and yet I must press on. Else I betray the promise I made her so long ago. So I write for her. How did that make you feel, P? Maybe she'll realize that when she is older, that is always fun, ruining people's childhoods. One of the noble family sponsoring the Merchant's Fair, unbeknownst to her uh, unrefined husband, she is quite active behind the scenes, dictating how the fairgrounds are to be decorated, as well as advising how the auctions are to be conducted. Alright, I still have anybody? I did it, okay. 25,000. Dazzling artwork. All right, well, we made some of our money back. Anyway, our main reason for coming here is actually uh, just to get this, though. We're gonna go back in here and we're gonna go get our treasure chest. Now that I'm actually recording, uh, so I need to remember to start my recording up at, again after we're done with, uh, or uh, go in and uh, clip that, highlight it. settle this like gentle. Can't we settle this like a gentleman? So, Pete, what are your thoughts on Octopath Traveler? I'll not be defeated. Instead of playing Samurai? Uh, don't feel too bad. I'm not very good with Samurai either. Either you'll figure it out though. Too slow. Out of my way. Oh damn! Put that asleep. Down he goes. I'll do my best. I still think my axe is my highest attack power weapon, so. Yeah, he fucking destroyed that. Oh, anyway, I was gonna say, um. Uh, P gave us a little bit of Ornstein and Smog uh, 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 history up here. I gotta go back and read it. He is one of the newer Dragon Knights, Smo, but he is super brutal, so he was placed under the watch of the Dragon Knight Captain Ornstein just to keep him in check. That is why Smo crushes him when he gets the chance. 
It's kind of annoying because of the items uh, the game will say something like the previous owner was uh, a skilled swordsman and then drop some random information about them and you have to f try and figure out who whose it was. So far, um, Ornstein and Smob have been really interesting as well as Artorius. Uh, or Artorius because, yeah, he just is. Uh, we've got Sif, uh, his grave. He was known as the Abyss Walker, according to that ring. It's one of those games you wanted to play and never got around to it. Me too, which is why I'm glad it was voted for on stream. Alright, we are actually going to be doing uh, Ulbrich's chapter next. So where is Ulbrich's chapter taking us? Over there. Alright, so the path over there is going to take us... How the fuck do we get over there? Do we go down from Quarry Crest? Uh, whatever, we'll figure it out. Artorius is basically the most badass. Well, don't spoil anything for me. I'm excited to find out. More of his lore in the DLC. Alright, so I gotta wait a while. Uh, okay. Uh, we're gonna wait at Primrose because she's my girl. I'm considering swapping um, uh, Ophelia back over to um, Alchemist or uh, Apothecary. Oops, no, I don't want. Oh, yeah, that's wrong. For a few reasons. One, the poison status effect is really good when she can't do any actual damage. And the other, um, with uh, Saltesia's Grace, I can actually AoE cast um, the inoculation ability. Which is super good. But yeah, I'm really excited about learning all these things about the the, the characters in that game. Uh, I think I'm, I've beaten 13 bosses so far. Which puts me at about... Um, May I have this dance? How have I fought, not fought these guys? May the sacred flame shine forth! What's this? Oh, you sapped his speed. That's too bad. Damn. Okay, here you go. And down he goes. I am ready. However, will I survive? I grow strong. Because there's what 26 bosses in the game. P. I've taken down 13. I can tell you this. I'm not excited to explore that uh, area underneath uh, where uh, ceaseless discharge was. I'll be uh, completely honest with you there. May I have this the hell? Well then. Venta Sota. I discovered an area that had a whole bunch of Taurus demons and Capra demons. That was um not great. Though, I think the first thing I'm going to do next time I play it, which will either be Thursday or Saturday, not sure yet. Um, Flame, protect us. Is I'm going to spend some time and uh, do my best. Ah! I'm ready. Uh, upgrade the gear that I have. Victory shall be mine. I will cut you down. And so I'm gonna farm some of the enemies in uh, Entolor because the Silver Knights are really easy to kill. <laughs> Which, by the way, I was, I was watching a video and these people said uh, this. Uh, this girl was saying how um, 
If there's any monster you want to learn how to, uh... If there's any monster in the game that you want to learn how to, uh... What the fuck? Uh, parry? That's the word. Um... It's, it's, it's gonna be, uh, the Silver Knights, because it's practically impossible to backstab them, and... And, um... Not bad. A parrying them makes them so easy to kill. And I was like, what do you mean it's practically impossible to backstab them? I, I, looking back at my playthrough, I fucking backstabbed almost every single one of them. So... The video was supposed to be about the remaster, but maybe in the original game they were practically impossible? Alright, we're not headed to this town. That's for Alfin. You know, I'm gonna go over to that town though, just so I can teleport to it later. May I have this dance? No, okay. Yeah, exactly. What's this? What's this? What's this now? Silence me, I'm not gonna bother with you. It's a waste of time. Affect my whole fucking party. Screw that. Can't we settle this like gentlemen? Alright, we got a spider. I am ready. The peacock struck. Ah, pincer. Okay, he's not weak to fire. We know that now. He is weak to sword. Victory shall be mine. Out of my way. Oh, the spider's asleep. Sick. The lion dance. My turn now. I'll not be defeated. The battle is truly joined. Out of my way. I should attack the other one. Woolly spider is asleep. Okay. Dead. They're dead. Pincer, you caught it! Harapi! Ophelia's 72 now. Alright, I'm just headed to the town here. Look at a dude up there. Dude, what the fuck? Why is this place so far away? I'm just trying to get to Orwell. Oh, these birds suck. Victory shall be mine. Okay, I can deal with that. Rude. Well then. An interesting dilemma. There you go. Once again, I gotta check Primrose because I got that dagger and I keep forgetting. P, how do you feel about the Cliff Bird King? You should have studied harder. Alright. Uh, what was I gonna do? Right, equipment. Primrose. We got a new dagger. It's a soul knife. If the Viper Dagger is good and all, but it lowers your elemental attack. Legion Dagger, same thing. But we got the Rune Knife, which increases it, and that's super important.
Yay, we made it! Now we can do immediately leave because... Actually, I'm gonna go back in there and use the end. Just to get Cyrus's MP back. I think I'll log in and do all the stealing and shit off stream. Because I don't think we're getting through all the chapters today. So, P, if you're a big fan of boss fights, this game has a lot of boss fights. Um, unfortunately, the vast majority of them seem to be um, random human NPC, but that's not that bad of a big of a deal. There, a lot of them are still really interesting despite that. And there are um, a lot of strategizing you can do to get through with some of them. Now, I am pretty overleveled. How about you? I don't feel like fighting these, they're annoying. Uh, I'm, I'm vastly over leveled, but that's just because A, this is my first playthrough, uh, B, it's for stream. If I was on my own, I probably wouldn't have leveled as much as I did. North Riverford Traverse. Okay, so this has to be... Uh, guys, there is another... Uh... There's another job uh, shrine in, on this map. So once we're done Olberg's chapter, we'll go and, uh, we'll go and do that. Man, the river for the, uh, the Riverlands are just filled with horrifyingly scary enemies. That and ass. Oh, you gotta do that. What is the logical course of action? Glacius, Lord Air. I am ready. Be in God. The Lord of the Flies. All right, Albrecht. You have a chance here. And you succeeded. He broke it. I am ready. He lived. I'll do my best. I am ready. All right, Albrecht. Time for you to finish this fuck off. <laughs> There he goes. With each battle, Frick! Frequency! I'm just gonna call you Frequency. You need to go back and play this on your Switch again? Never even finished it once? You're lazy? Oh no! There's a lot to this game. Like, if you're going through every chapter like I, I have on stream, I, I could see it being easy to burn out. But, you should go back to it. It actually has been pretty solid. And it feels great when you get, find the strategy or make a character super powerful. You surprised your foe. Oh, the week to fire. That was gonna be my next guess. The battle is truly joined. Like when you get sorcerer skills. His hands literally become flamethrowers. No, okay. Yeah, augment the guy who is clearly almost dead. Be in my Look at that. And down they go. The flame guides us true. No. Uh, you can do all the chapter four is. All the chapters in the same play, uh, play same play file. Uh, this is my first and only uh, only one here. You make your way to Riverford, where you hope to find the mercenary War uh, Werner, the man behind the fall of Hornberg. Sorry, so far in Wellspring, Oldberg reunited with Erhart. It was there where that his erstwhile comrade that had sought uh, atonement for his deeds. The two crossed blades, and with that act, the truth was told. Erhard told Ulbrich about Werner, a former sellsword, and ver uh, the very man who had orchestrated the fall of Hornberg. Such a friend is too dangerous for this world. Our fiend is too dangerous for this world. I will stop him. I must. Gone are the doubts that plagued Ulbrich's heart to protect the people from harm. This is why he wields his blade as he came to Riverford. The very air was thick with unease and fear. 
I think I've only got about 80 hours in the game so far. Mm. Oi! If you want in town, you get in the queue and wait your turn with the rest. Mm. Queue? Huh, beg your pardon. <laughs> a gentleman? I presume I must have misjudged your polished bearing, sir. Tell me, what brings you to this town? The truth is... I'm looking for a man. Is that so? Indeed. I take it this is your first visit, so let me give you some free advice. You'll be wanting to press a few leaves into the palms of the gods. <sighs> There's a toll? Hmm. Not a toll as such. You see, the lord what? here... Eh? What's that you say about at all? I heard a knot of that afore. Oh, Only yeah. 80. Shut your gob! And what's this tincture in your sack? Smuggler, are you? What? Oh, what? That ain't mine, I swear I'm in mother's grave! Yeah. Of course it ain't. I'd suggest you confess your crimes here and now, unless you'd rather tell it to the master at arms. He's holding him. He's holding his hand. Hmm. And that, good sir, is why you'll want some spare coin at the ready. <sighs> but the law... Those men are the law here. Their rule is absolute, I'm sorry to say. No bot. Uh, I think it's just... Uh, I think there is a follow command for it, but... Uh, I think it's just exclamation point follow. Or uh, follow age. No doubt that potion was the guard's own. There you go. Defy them at your own peril. Or defy them at your, your peril. A pretext to toss you in their jail is at the ready. What? It's a command I don't see used very often. Does no one bring them to task for their deeds? Afraid not. Not I. I can tell you that. I do exactly as they tell me, as should you. Punishment is swift and harsh here, both for those who have broken the law and those who have not. A handful of leaves serves my advice. The more you can spare, the better. I only pray the poor traveler has the wits and means to give soldiers what they see. Eek. Swoons. Almost. And what the uh, what of the lord of this place? Does he not? He does nothing to stop this mummery. He encourages it. You see, ever since Lord Werner took over here. Oi, stop prattling and stop moving! <gasps> yes, sir, a thousand pardons. My turn. Perhaps we'll meet again inside. Aye. Werner is the lord? By the gods, what happened here? Yeah. Yep, uh, I, I played through... Uh, Hmm. Three of the chapter fours and beat two of the uh, bosses that uh, give bonus jobs. Another scruffy vagabond? Let's see what's ru ru rubbish you're toting in that bag. Whoa. Will this do? Whoa. Quick on the uptake, this one. Keep that up and you'll do all right in this town, mate. Very well. Might I ask a question, good sir? About this man, Werner. Huh? Th that's Lord Werner to the likes of you. What business could you be having with his lordship? No. No business, friend. Just wondering what kind of man Lord Werner is. <clears throat> hey, he's bleeding wonderful here. Best thing whatever happened to this town. Now piss off. We got work to do. I see. By your leave. Bonus jobs. BJ's. Yes, P. BJ's. There was this fear in the... There was fear in those eyes. A sellsword captain turned provincial lord. This Werner certainly moved up in the world. Travel banter? Good heavens. The town is in turmoil, which is exactly what I'd expect after seeing the behavior of those charged with policing it. Still, it'll be no small task getting at Werner. A difficult foe, to be sure. If there was ever a time when I was in need of a scholar's wisdom, it is now. Then it is most fortunate I am here now. I do have some thoughts, as it happens. An oppressive regime such as this is bound to foster discontent and dissatisfaction. I suggest seeking out the victims. Find those who are most downtrodden, 
who are suffering the greatest. They will tell you what you need to know. I see. I shall do as you counsel. You will? I trust your knowledge and insight, else I would not have asked. Well then, it is an honor to be of service. More travel banter. Hmm. It's not every day you hear of a mercenary leader becoming a provincial lord. Indeed. He must have been very fortunate or exceedingly clever. Don't be naive, old brick. In this world, corruption and dirty dealings are the only way a man can rise that fast. Mark my words, his path to fortune is littered with the bodies of men with knives in their backs. And I don't just mean figuratively, either. Yours is a most cynical outlook. Trust me, I speak from experience. I know that his type when I see it. You do well to know what you're getting into if you're picking a fight with him. Fear not. When the swords are drawn, a corrupt man is cut down as easily as any other. <laughs> then we've got nothing to worry about. Did you know that P uh, self-identifies as a corrupt man? This looks like burning people at the stake. What is this? <sighs> Ain't never seen a pyre before? It's for his lordship's burning. Once a month, some poor sap gets tied to them stakes and burned alive for the sins. Indeed. For this month, for last month, and for the month uh, for that too. The law of the land it is. <sighs> Used to be outlaws and rogues that woke up and. But it weren't long before it were drunks and beggars up there for their slightest crimes. Shouldn't say this out loud, but nowadays all it takes is a cavil at his lordship's rule. And thus the pall that oppresses this place. Uh. No one knows who'll finger you for what, so we creep about like mice doing our best not to be noticed. Try to scarp or two and poof, just looking guilty or someone will seal the deal. Uh. So, traveler, now you know the kind of place you're fetched up into. Best finish your business and be on your way as soon as you can. It is very sustainable, P. Especially in a town of people that, that where there's like 16 NPCs. Now, if you'll be excusing me. That town will last at least, at least four months. <gasps> Burning people at the stake! How horrible! It is a dreadful way to die. The final moments are agony. How would you know? But that makes it all the more effective as a lesson to others. Those who would rule with terror must embrace terror. Wrongdoers need to be punished. Everyone agrees with that, but this just goes beyond justice. Just so. I grow so sad thinking about the poor people who live here. This cannot be allowed to go on. We have to do something. Agreed. Yet if we act too hastily, we shall lose all hope of saving them. We must have patience if we are to prevail. So we just stand by and watch, is that it? It is hard to do so, but yes. Damn, only four left. Exactly. Alright, you know what we can do, though? We can switch to Therian and actually commit crimes in this town. Oops. Oh, I want Therian. And we'll put... Uh, Damn it! A soldier who carries out the commands of his lord with, in, without enthusiasm, he does the bare minimum to show that he is not judged to be derelict in his duties. At least, no more than the guard who stands beside him. I got a gargantuan show. P the Magic D! This has happened. They burn criminals, and they burn... Oh, I don't want to challenge that person. Why? Right, fuck. Why do I still have trash? Why am I failing at making my party what I want it to be? Alright, got your shield. 
A soldier who carries out the commands of his lord without enthusiasm. Okay, it's the exact same. Ah, oh, sect, my stealing has doubled in this town. Unseen saber. Occasionally confuses the target. Accuracy goes down, but your evasion goes up. So fucking right, we'll do that. And it can confuse targets. Hell yes. Hey, lady. Hello there. I am a maidservant in the employ of Sir Cervantes. Unfortunately, his lordship has seen fit to leave home and go a wandering in search of adventure. He spouted some nonsense about being a chosen something or other, and then clanked off in the family armor. I do wish he had someone to accompany him and keep him safe. A woman in the employ of Sir Cervantes. She has served his family since he was a mere, more or more than no more than a child, and cannot help but think of as a younger brother. His boundless recklessness is a constant source of worry. Give me your jam. Right, I gotta talk to these two. Oi! Oi! Less of that unless you want to face the stake. Huh? Don't go telling me you're gonna revolt against the Lord. Okay. That was a big jump in logic there. Hang on, we gotta eat a bean though because P subscribed. Frequency, did you tell me who your favorite character in this is? All right. We got dirty dishwater or Birthday cake. Hmm. Birthday cake. A good one. Hmm. Nobody blow me told me but no toll? I barely escaped a roasting at the stake. That's a roasting. Good day. I usually charge a toll, but I'll wave it just Come this on. once. Go on before I change my mind, but don't tell anyone. Uh, so, okay, that's the exact same as every other person. I suspect we're all we're gonna get the same scrutiny for each one. Pomegranate and fire soul stone. So what you want to do whenever you get to a town is just go around and steal everything. Fair and well. I'm a farmer by trade, but treasure hunting's my passion. My latest undertaking is a search for the lost loot of House Landar. The Landers were highborn folk in this town, and they were famed for hoarding treasure. Find the treasure of their hidden loot will be my ticket to exclusive League of Gentlemen Discoverers. All right, here you go. Aha! So the last Lord of Landers was denounced for corruption and slain by an arrow when he tried to flee. By then, the family had fallen into ruin and didn't even have the coin to pay the house god. If that's how it all ended, then there's no hidden treasure left anywhere I want. Well, better to know that now than go on chasing something that don't exist. A good treasure hunter knows when to give up on one chase and move on to the next. Suppose I'll have to stick to the farming for a while longer, at least. And in between the times, I'll keep looking for stories of other hidden odds. Thanks be to you for bringing word. I'm most grateful. Hey, look at that money. Money, money, yeah, yeah. Probably should have stolen from him first, but whatever. Let's see now. This old man originally served as a butler in the Lord's Manor, but lost his position when the Lord was overthrown. He then resigned himself to a quiet life in town and withdrew into hiding after his former colleague, the gardener, was put to death by the new Lord. Damn. It's gotta suck to lose your friend. Aw, oh, shit. Tough nut. Alright, I have a nut I can give to... You? Really? You're so much faster now? much it adds to factor in the toll when coming here to trade. This merchant visits Riverford on a regular basis. In the past, the town's economy was booming and he frequently ran into many of the, his business associates here. However, since the change of local lordship, these encounters have become fewer, fewer and farther between. That's because those people have been burned. Literally, they're 
not just the bridges, but everything. Alright, this is a house that doesn't even have a bed in it. Alright, let's get some spiriting plums. There we go. Okay, Jade Lance, that's not better than what you got. Sword of Bravery, that's better than what Therian's got, but we already have one of those, I think. Knight Shield, Platinum Helm, not really better. Platinum Armor, not really better. I mean, you get a little bit of better physical defense, but you lose so much. Oh, you can get healing grape bunches here. I'm not gonna buy all of them, but I'll buy 20 of those. There you go. Head east, down this road to get to the residential district. I suggest you move along, and quickly. Move along, sir. Blessed with the unbending will, this soldier has survived the most trying of times. From when the river flooded, to when fire ravaged the town, to when the Lord was overthrown, in the face of these hardships, he remembered the words of his dead mother. So long as the spirit endures, all else can be rebuilt. What do you got? Nourishing nut. Give this one to Cyrus. Tough nut. Critical nut. Dude is 27 and been through all this shit? Yes. And now to make his life worse. Is a good day for I show up and just beat the, the fuck out of him. He's not weak to swords. Oh, he made me weaker. Too slow. <laughs> no, okay. He is weak to spear, though. How about you? It sucks for him being weak to spear. How about you? And here's why. Death by a thousand cuts. The battle. My is unbending! I wreak havoc upon thee! He's still alive. Have at you. Ha! Out of my way! Have at you. Out of my way! Dude, he's doing damage to me, but it's not actually doing any damage to me. The battle is truly joined. Dude, why did that not give me attack up? I don't understand. The battle is truly joined. Battle is truly oh, he's dead. Well, that was a waste. With You're a dragon. I grow Kinda. Strong. And I leveled up from that. Alright, so this guy's a fine fight that was. You have my thanks. And then I rob him. I go into his house and steal his jam. He has fire magic that does fuck all. Four damage. Right, but it wasn't even damaging my HP. Like, it was saying it was doing damage, but my HP wasn't going down. Maybe they just had to put a value there, but it didn't actually have any value. Oops. Okay, we're, I guess we're stealing first. A giant's club. A soul stone. Let's see now. A self-appointed leader of the downtrodden in Riverford. She looks after the poor and persecuted, and others whose various misfortunes have laid them low. For her kindness and wisdom, she is widely respected, and even the soldiers will acquiesce to her demands. Challenge with ease. Alright. 